Welcome to the Investment Properties for Sales Show. Folks, thing is selling at or above list. We are going to provide you guys with complete transparency and education. We take you to the video tour. Won't lie to you, giving it to you straight. How much the four unit apartment buildings cost in Cleveland these days, right? 200, two and a quarter, 250. I've seen some as high as 300,000 on the west side. And folks, I got one on the west side for a fraction of the cost. Woo, look at that. 9003 Denison. All right, $139,900. Now, this is discounted heavily for a couple reasons, not just because I'm just a super splendid guy. No, uh, this property definitely needs some love, okay? What we have, obviously, four units. We're getting rent from one of them, 450 a month. Uh, that is a long-term inherited legacy tenant, okay? The current uh, market rent for that unit should be about 650 So he's 200 bucks under market rent then of course the second unit which is the unit you're viewing that is vacant you need to put a little bit of coin into that unit right probably get that thing buttoned up for like i don't know maybe like let's just call it 10 because we're gonna have to do some lead work too right so let's just let's just pencil in about 10 g's of work here right and then we have units three and four which are both current tenants that are not paying rent right so the current seller uh, does not, he's a distressed seller, does not want to deal with any of those evictions, right? So what you're getting uh, is one under market rent tenant, one vacant unit, and two units that we need to throw some non-paying sons of bitches out of the house, right? That's what we got to do. Sometimes real estate investing gets messy. This is going to be one of those times. But that is why the property is not 200, not two and a quarter, not 250, not 300,000. No, no, no. It's being offered to you at the bare bottom price of 139.9, right? How often do you get the opportunity to pull off a bird deal on a quad? Almost never, folks. And quads, for all those out there uh, who are new to my show, you should know that I find the quad to be the greatest investment a new real estate investor could make, right? It's because of the financing. You see, financing is why you guys should be in the real estate game, right? There's other things you could do. You could trade cryptocurrency. You could sell stuff on eBay and Amazon and Facebook Marketplace. You could open up a pizza shop. You could do a lot of things in the world of business. But none of those things are going to involve the bank giving you 75% of the money needed for the business and giving it to you for a course of 30 years, low fixed interest, tax deductible interest, right? You could only do that with real estate and you could only get that type of loan on one to four unit properties, okay? And folks, two rent checks is better than one, three rent checks is better than two, four rent checks is better than three, right? Four unit apartment buildings are the biggest apartment buildings one can buy and still get the very best financing the world has to offer, right? So that's why I love quads. And of course, the burst strategy is an amazing strategy to make money. Buy, renovate, rent, refinance, repeat. You buy yourself a distressed asset, which is what we currently have here. You renovate it, right? You remove both tenants. Fix up all the units, right? When everything is kicking, everything is cooking, you're looking at $2,600 a month in rent. How much money is it going to take to get us there? Well, I'd say we could probably pencil in, I would say maybe 40 k 40 k total, right? 40 k total. What that 40 k would do would get you past your evictions, get you those other three units being rent ready, Market rent six fifty a month, and probably get you lead certified because the house, of course, is not lead certified. Um, for those of you who have no idea what lead certification is, uh, in the notes below I have an entire tutorial on the lead certification process in the city of Cleveland that is new. Right, this just happened. Right, these are brand new laws. A lot of realtors don't even know about these laws. Right, if you cruise through the MLS, you'll find most rental properties are being sold with no mention of this. Y'all better watch out because if you buy a property that has a ton of lead work, ooh, you could look at like a thirty, forty thousand dollar bill just for that. This one I don't anticipate having a ton of 
uh, lead work, right? Because you're going to get all fresh interior paint and things of that nature inside those three units with the turns. And then the big costs are usually going to be on the outside. If you have something with like wood siding, you usually need a r vinyl side. It's the most cost effective way to do it. And that's going to be huge cost. But you don't have to do that here, right? So I believe here we're roughly 40K away from being lead certified and fully occupied, bringing in a massive amount of rent. So again, for those of you who are good at math, you're still way under 200, way under 225, way under 250, okay? This deal makes a lot of money, but of course, it's a little distressed, so it's going to be a bumpy ride getting you there, but the payoff is going to be there in the end. So if this kind of investment makes sense for you, simply send your offer to my team, sales at holtonwise.com. Uh, cash offers are probably going to be what uh, is needed to take this sucker down, find it very unlikely we're going to be able to do uh, get financing to go through. Property needs repairs, number one. Number two, we have two tenants in there that are being evicted. For those of you new to the real estate game, tenants that need to get evicted, they're not being evicted. They need to get evicted. You'll have to evict them after it closes. Whether you have Holton Wise uh, stay on as the property manager, we will evict them for you, or you want to do it on your own. Uh, tenants who need to be evicted are usually not cooperative. So, like, if you think they're going to be like, oh, hey, Mr. Appraiser, come on in my unit. It's totally cool. I'm stealing from the owner, but I'm going to be nice to you. Yeah, it don't work that way, right? So cash offers are pretty much going to be what we need, folks. So send those in. Sales at HoldenWise.com. Let me know how much you want to offer and include your proof of funds. For those of you good at math, you'll see. The ARV, much higher than the purchase and acquisition cost here. So very good candidate for the birth strategy, meaning there's probably going to be a big old bidding war. So be aggressive. No low ball offers. Let's get this done. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.